very special for you here. From the Revolutionary War to Ernest Hemingway novels for nearly five decades, she has captured and documented American history with the stroke of a paintbrush. And she's celebrating her 100th birthday. Meet Kay Smith. Lauren Jiggetts has the story of one of Chicago's very own. Last month, Illinois artist laureate Kay Smith, along with family and friends, celebrated her milestone birthday. Today I'm 100. With a proclamation from the city of Chicago dedicating February 27th as Kay Smith Day, the centenarians sip champagne and enjoy the festivities. Happy birthday. But Smith is also a celebrated artist. Born in Vindalia, Illinois, Smith moved to Chicago to study at the Art Institute of Chicago. There she honed her watercolor skills, and those are skills that are reflected in her wide collections of art. But watercolor is so beautiful, and a splash might come too soon, or oh, there's a lot of ways it just knocks you out of the box. In 1974, Smith was commissioned to illustrate a series of books <laughs> celebrating the bicentennial. They wanted to deal with uh, something to do with Valley Forge because it was, uh, I mean, they spent a horrible winter there. The American Legacy Collection is comprised of more than 250 pieces of work by Smith. From Valley Forge to the Statue of Liberty, Smith often painted on site to accurately depict and document history. One of Smith's favorite paintings hangs on her living room wall. Mount Rushmore is a pretty good painting. Throughout her esteemed career, Smith has been commissioned to paint famed Triple Crown Racehorse winner Secretariat, as well as a series of illustrations based on Ernest Hemingway novels. In 1994, she was awarded the prestigious honor of Illinois Artist Laureate by the Lincoln Academy of Illinois. And in 2015, she painted this scene of Tuskegee Airmen escorting bombers during World War II, a piece requested by the Pritzker Military Library, where it hangs today. I like painting like this. A bit of a perfectionist when it comes to her work, she says taking the time to research is key. I don't see how you can do something good if you don't know what it is. Kay Smith, she's one of Chicago's very own. And in addition to her work, Smith also taught watercolor art for 20 years at the Old Town Triangle Art Center.